What's going on guys? This is Selfjam06 on the coming match with a brand new video. Today I will be showing you how to earn more relic points in Uncharted 4 in Peace and Multiplayer. So I'm here at the main menu of multiplayer, and in the multiplayer side we have two currencies in game. We have relic points and uncharted points. Relic points are the purple ones, and those are points you earn in game. Uncharted points are the yellow ones, and those you buy with actual money. Both of those are displayed at the bottom right hand side of the screen. So let's go to the store real quick. I'm here at the opening screen of the store, and it just gives a general overview of items we can buy in the store. Uncharted points are used to purchase specific items, guaranteed items. Relic points are used to purchase chests. These are random items. They remind me of supply drops from Call of Duty and case openings from CSGO, that sort of stuff. Uh, random items inside, you don't know what you're going to get, and they're really fun to open. So we have four different types of chests. We have vanity chests, mystical and sidekick mod chests, hero weapon chests, and one use booster chests. Uh, what's inside of these, as I said, is random. So, how to earn more of these. So, there are three ways to earn relic points in Uncharted for multiplayer. The first is by winning matches. Every time you win a match, you get 10 relic points to spend. The second way, you'll see on the right hand side of the screen, uh, I open like uh, challenges. Um, I display challenges that I have available. Um, by doing those challenges, some of them are really easy, like use any mystical. That's so that's so simple. Really, really easy to do. And once you complete that challenge, you get like 350 points, 250, 320, somewhere in that range. That's how many points you'll get for completing that challenge. Now. That's a, those are a bit harder to earn because you're playing against other people. I have a way to guarantee that you earn relic points. So let's go to trials. So trials are like tutorials for every specific thing in the game that is new besides like actually aiming, firing, that sort of stuff. And as you see, we have gear, sidekick, mysticals um, for trials. So let's go down to uh, the mystical staff of IR Manco. So it says the difficulty is moderate, the goal is $2,000, and the reward is claimed. Look at that, the reward is claimed. So by doing this trial, I earn 50 relic points. And it was super easy to do. The next one, on hard difficulty, the goal goes up and you earn an extra 50 points for completing this. So you get another 100 points for completing this trial on hard. As you see, I've done quite a few of these on hard already. I'm almost done. So if you complete these on crushing difficulty, you get 150 relic points. So if you look at the bottom right hand side of my screen, I have 1580 relic points and I've earned most of these by completing these trials. I just started going through them one by one and I got them done in about half an hour, all of them on the screen right here. Um, so this is only a one time use. After these trials, you can't earn any more relic points. So it's a one-time use, but it's a great way to get started so that you can open chests and get all sorts of cool stuff for your characters, um, skins, new characters, taunts, all that fun stuff. So those are the three ways to earn relic points, and that's how you earn them really, really quickly in Uncharted 4 with Thieves and Multiplayer. So uh, I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please like, please comment down below what your favorite, um, what your favorite taunt is. Tell me what your favorite taunt is, and uh, 
please subscribe to my channel. That would really help my channel grow. And I'll see you guys in my next video.